in this set of videos, I'm going to show you how to use the references area within Microsoft Word. But in order to do that, I'm, we have to have a document. So I'm going to open up a report. Let's see if there's one I haven't used yet. Um, this looks good. Go to create. In the document name, we're gonna type our name. And then type today's date in the subtitle. And here, we're gonna to go to the second page, go to references, and we're going to add a table of contents. You can do insert table of contents, and then here you can pick what kind of format you want. So let's pick fancy, I like fancy, hit okay. And now you have a table of contents. And of course, it's kind of going through here. So we're also going to do a page break we can say insert a page break. We can do a continuous page break. There's also section breaks. So um, let's maybe do, we're gonna do a page break. Uh, indicate the text, yeah, yeah, yeah. No, just do a regular page break. And now we have a table of contents. And here at the end, let's do another page break. We're gonna do a page break here and now we're going to add a works cited page so you can do insert citation oh no sorry you can do bibliography and we can either choose a bibliography or a works cited page and we can click on And see, even the works cited page, it says there's no sources in the current document. But if we had typed this and we put work, cited works here, um, then it would be included in here. And it kind of just picks it up. Work, Microsoft Word has made for really easy report writing. So let's save this report and save as the documents. We're going to save it as report. And that's the quick and easy way to add a table of contents and a works cited pages to any reports that you're ever writing.